Praise the Lord, Saints. What's happening, y'all? How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? Got a professional voice on. Y'all, we are um, in Wynwood right now, which is um, an area in Miami, for those of you guys who are not familiar. Um, we, we live here, and we don't ever come down here and do none of the touristy stuff that we have in our own city. So we are being tourists in our own city. That's what's happening today. So um, we about to walk around here and see what home has to offer. Um, but we're gonna bring y'all along. Hopefully you guys can enjoy and see what we got going on. Whatever you go into, just know that you gon' get out. Focus on just doing you, they always running their mouth. Keep the faith when it ain't great. Show them love when they show hate. Want it now, but God say wait. That's the way to test my faith. That's my mantra, yeah, that's the answer. When life go faster, leave it all in the past, uh, no really in the past, uh. Put my soul on the path and I pray. I'm praying that you got my way. So just a quick check-in. We just what's happening, y'all? So listen. Okay. As you can tell the energy is different. <laughs> the energy is different. <laughs> <laughs> we just left from eating, drinking. What was that place we was? It was called I don't know what it was. Margarita, called. Margarita, Mamitas, Carnitas, something like that. It was Spanish, but um. We got margaritas from there. We had um, Don Julio shots. And then I ate the absolute worst quesadilla. Why would you I've ever say that about the No, it was bad. Listen, we live here and we don't even really come here. And it's so crazy. But it's a vibe. It is. It's a vibe. And not like, only that, it's like the art the, the yeah, art yeah. on the wall, the creativity. It's like a lot going on down here. Actually, great things um, mm -hmm. going on down here. <laughs> it's amazing but anyway we are walking around right now seeing what what, what they got going on what here. are we doing they didn't hear what we said we're, doing. we're walking around right now seeing what they got going on down here um and we're just trying new things um because like i said this is tourists in our own city tourists in our own city which is so crazy because we go to other cities y'all come to us with us to other cities y'all come with us y'all come with us Keep it together, Duran. I feel like it's. I, I feel like it's a Don Julio this cover. I said we gotta call y'all back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so I feel sorry. Like, you see me I'm messing up your ankles? It's just a lot going on. It is a lot going on. Sorry, now sorry. I got it. I don't even have lotion with me. Y'all, I feel like we are lost in Wynwood. Like we're trying to find the walls for the art, and yeah. we don't even know okay. where it's at. It's somewhere down here, though. Miami people, where the hell y'all be going down here when y'all come to Wynwood? <laughs> And y'all look for the art. Y'all be taking pictures in front of the graffiti builders. Now, I know they're random and sporadic throughout here. But, like, where is that? Where's That's what the, I'm trying to figure out, too. Where's the things? Because we walking around here, and it's like, okay, this is a nice place to take a picture. This is a nice place And I used my GPS where to find that? somewhere. It said Winwood Art Walk. And I went there, and it was actually. It was a corner store. It was a it, boutique. Well, like, what was I don't the, know what that was. It, was. it wasn't the art walls that I wanted to see. It was I a storefront. That. It wasn't that. It was a storefront. It wasn't an actual. Oh, I see some Let's go down here. See that? That's the lady this with the attitude. Came from. Yeah, oh, that's the one with the attitude. A real bad attitude. And they tried to say she was sick. Let me if show you. She was in their coffin, and you see why? I'm <laughs> she over here puffing on these Newports. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> Let me not talk about God children. I'm not going to talk about God kids. That's right, because he loves us all. Mama feel like she top flight, though. For real. But you see her telling people something? Look, 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 look. Top look, flight look. on the world, Craig. Look, look. Sure, 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 sure. Duan, why would you do that? Give it to her. Why would you do that? No, because both are kind of attitude. We see a little bit of walls, though. We see a little bit of walls coming up. It's a little art. It's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. But we'll find it. We'll definitely. Clap for me because I made it out. Clap for me, you know I made it out. Clap for me because I made it out. Clap, 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 clap. Clap for me because I made it out. Clap for me because I made it out. We are in this hip hop museum. We just saw it on the way. We don't even know where we. First off, we don't even know where we was walking. We just saw a hip hop museum, and I said, "Hey, let's go there." And we decided to go here. And not only that, it's like a lot of pictures and a lot of things that represent hip hop in here. So of course, we're gonna show y'all what that stuff looks like. Big bang, taking little bang. Uh -huh. Bottles popping, Kobe pouring drinks. Real loud, cause you know it's dang. Getting money like a Shark Tank. Big bang, taking little bang. Bottles popping cause we pouring drinks Real loud cause you know it's dang Getting money like a shark tank I'm 
on the come up if I want up. They trying to take my bands from my brand, better run up. If it ain't about the money, if it ain't about the cost, then tell me what's the price when you trying to be a boss. I just really want to live, but the price going up. I want a new job, but they trying to pay cut. Man, I really feel stuck. Gotta act like I don't give a fuck. But I do, but I don't, so I guess that I won't. Big yeah. bang, taking little bang. Uh-huh. Bottles popping, Kobe pouring drinks. Real loud, cause you know it's dang. Getting money like a shark tank. So we just left the hip hop museum. It was better than I thought it would be. I didn't think it would be as interesting. It as was it actually was. really dope. So if y'all come down down here, um, definitely check out the hip hop museum. It was really dope. And shout out to the young lady. Y'all don't know what her name was, but she really just spoke a whole word over us. Was like, she a young lady? <laughs> I'm not even trying to be. I'm not even trying to be. See, Dewan is just messy. Dewan is messy. I'm not even trying to be. You was, are messy. I just no, asked, she, was she a young lady? It was, it was given middle age. It was okay. Maybe like, you, you're right. Okay. You're right. But it, anyway, shout out to her. She to the elder. The work. Yeah. Okay. Shout out to the elder <laughs> because she really gave us some words of wisdom. Yeah, she really she did. She pretty much cause, unsolicited, but that's okay. We, I'm, yeah. I'm grateful for it. Because what she said it. was, and like, I mean, a lot of people talk about this. The person who owns the hip hop museum is not an African American. Was, the man was in there. She was like, "Look at him." So, <laughs> so yeah. Sometimes you know, um, they take our culture and they try to. Um, what word am I looking for? They try to publicize our culture in a way where we're not the ones who's behind it. That part. Like they they take our culture and they showcase it for their benefit and not necessarily for the benefit of us. Right. And y'all know what I mean by that when I say our culture. I'm not even going to go in depth on that. But yeah. Um, and she pretty much was telling us like, you know, whatever gifts and talents and things that we have, use it to our full advantage. Because if we don't use it to our full advantage, we just use it to our, I guess, our basic advantage. The next person who is not a part of our culture can yeah. benefit off it or profit, profit off of it. Yeah. So that's a whole word. She was that was a nice. word of advice. Yeah, absolutely. It was wonderful, but I had a good time. We have a good time. We had a good time. Um, so now we are about to possibly leave. Big bang, take it, little bang. Bottles popping, cause we pouring drinks. Real loud, cause you know it's dang. Getting money like a shark day. Shark day, shark day, shark day, shark day, shark day, shark day. So I am on the way to the studio. I am a bit nervous. Like, I get nervous sometimes when I go to the studio, cause I have the sound of what I want my music to sound like in my head and I just hope that it comes out the way I hear it in my head. So um, yeah, I'm a bit nervous, but usually I'd be nervous and then when I leave, I'd be like on cloud nine because everything comes out good, but it's still that nervousness. So something I forgot to mention is that I don't record at the studio, I record at home and I take it to the studio for mixing and mastering. I just feel like when I'm at home, I, I'm more in a comfortable environment, so I'm able to like just be a little more free without anyone actually hearing me while I record or anyone actually being there when I record. So the song is already recorded, so you won't see the recording of the song, but you will see the mixing of the song. A little bit more than usual. It just seems like you got a lot of yeah, I tried vocal stuff. You got some harmony. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah, I see it. You know, harmony, yeah. harmony, harmony. But a lot of it though is the same. Okay. Like as far as. Um, uh -huh. All right. Yeah. Let's get into it. <laughs> Tell you, homie, she ain't think about you. I can tell you, homie, that I know that you're tripping. Cause she wanna 
of a kind, ain't like them other women. She said she sick of your shit, took a picture, posted. Tell a nigga to kick rocks, to kick rocks. If he wanna pull up, then he get off. This ain't Twitter, got an exes on the ground, they close friends, so they see how we live, they like, damn. I'm the man, hot the man, I'll check a real life, pick a story, you know me, man. I'm sticking to the plan that you gave me, gave me. I gotta stay true to my legacy, legacy. Working and working and working and working. 